The Gospel of the Holy Mother, Sri Sharada Devi. Reminiscences and Conversations recorded by Swami Arupananda. Place Udbodhan Prayer Hall, year 1910. The Holy Mother was sorting bay leaves for the daily worship. When I showed her, one of the photographs of her that had been printed recently, I asked if it was a good likeness of hers. Mother, yes, this is a very good picture, but I was stouter before it was taken. Yogin, referring to Swami Yogananda, was very ill at that time, worrying about him I became emaciated. I was very unhappy then. I would weep when Yogin's illness took a turn for the worse and I would feel happy when he felt better. Mrs. Sarabul took this photograph. At first I did not agree to it, but she insisted and said, Mother, I shall take this picture to America and worship it. At last, the picture was taken. Arupananda Mother, that photograph of Sri Ramakrishna which you have with you is a very good one. One feels it when one sees the picture. Well, is that a good likeness of the Master? Mother Yes, that picture is very, very good. It originally belonged to a Brahmin cook. Several prints were made of his first photograph. The Brahmin took one of them. The picture was at first very dark, just like the image of Mother Kali. Therefore, it was given to the Brahmin. When he left the Kineshwar for some place, I don't remember where, he gave it to me. I kept the photograph with the pictures of other gods and goddesses and worshipped it. At that time, I lived on the ground floor of the Nahabat. One day, the master came there and at the sight of the picture, he said, Hello. What is all this? Lakshmi and I had been cooking under the staircase. Then I saw the master take in his hand the bay leaves and flowers kept there for worship and offered them to the photograph. He worshipped the picture. This is the same picture that Brahmin never returned. So the picture remained with me. Disciple, Mother, did you ever see the face of the Master to be pale at the time of his Samadhi? Mother, Why? I don't remember to have seen it so. On the other hand, I always saw a smile on his face in his ecstatic mood. Arupananda, It is possible to have a smile during the state of emotional ecstasy that is Bhava Samadhi. But regarding the photograph of his sitting posture, the master had said that it was a picture of a very exalted state. Is it possible to have a smile in that state? Mother, but I have seen him smile in all states of Samadhi. Disciple, 
Of what complexion was he? Mother. His complexion was like the color of gold, like that of Haritaal, that is, yellow or pigment. His complexion blended with the color of the golden amulet which he wore on his arm. When I used to rub him with oil, I could clearly see a luster coming out of his entire body. A youth with a fair complexion once came to the Kali temple at the Kineshwar. The master said to me, both of us, he was referring to the man and himself, will walk side by side in the Panchvati. You judge who is the fairer of the two. They started walking and I observed that the youth was slightly fairer than the master. He was 19 or 20 years old. Mother continued. When the master would come out of his room in the temple, people used to stand in line and say to one another, Ah, there he goes. He was fairly stout. Mathur Babu gave him a low stool to sit on. It was a rather wide stool, but it was not quite big enough to hold him comfortably when he would squat on it to take his meal. People would look at him wonderstruck when he went with slow, steady steps to the Ganges to take his bath. Oh. Uh...